Ladies and gentlemen, the problem. You are a track IR user and you're trying to play Star Citizen. When you activate your head tracking, the helmet's HUD decides to move all over the screen, even though you've kindly asked it not to. Now, the solution is to go into your head tracking software and disable X, Y, Z, or Z, depending where you hail from. Now, what this is actually going to do if we re-enable Track IR is continue to provide you with yaw and pitch. And if you use roll, you'll still have that. I don't really tend to use it, but it's going to disable your ability to move your head forward, as indicated here, backward, side to side. Things that may be useful in some games, but honestly aren't going to cause much of a problem in Star Citizen. It would seem that the head within the helmet in Star Citizen actually moves around, and this is causing most of your problem. So now, if we go back to the game, we can see that I'm able to freely move my head about the cockpit, and the helmet HUD UI elements stay put. Now, this might not necessarily be ideal for some of you. I believe that it is supposed to move around with your head tracking, but as of right now, this makes for a far better experience. The self-status and target indicators do not get in your way. Uh, ideally, I would like these to be removable, some sort of toggle. I would much rather focus on the MFDs uh, within the ship. But for now, this is a fantastic solution and much better than what we were dealing with before. Special thanks to Ritu for pointing this fix out to me. And if you know anyone that uses Track IR or are thinking about getting it yourself, make sure to go ahead and share this. Track IR 5 is a fantastic device and deserves the very best support from a game like Star Citizen. So with that said, thank you so much for joining me. I'll see you on the next one.